Hi everyone, I am Dr. Maria Cristina Alolod, a board-certified nephrologist at St. Luke's Medical Center. And our topic for today is chronic kidney disease, signs, symptoms, and diagnosis. Kidney disease is the seventh in the top 10 causes of mortality according to the 2018 Philippine Health Statistics. Our kidneys play a vital role in keeping our body healthy as they function in the removal of waste products, regulation of water, and electrolytes. The kidneys are also integral in hormone production to control the blood pressure, maintenance of healthy bones, and help in red blood cell production. Chronic kidney disease occurs when a condition that impairs kidney function results from structural or functional abnormalities of kidneys greater than 3 months manifested by decreased GFR of less than 60 ml per minute and or protein in the urine. So the estimated glomerular filtration rate is an estimate of our kidney function. Patients who are hypertensive, diabetics, and with a family history of kidney disease are at risk for developing CKD. Patients who frequently use NSAIDs and patients who had history of acute kidney injury are also at risk for developing CKD. Unlike other diseases, a patient with CKD may be asymptomatic on the early stages. In advanced CKD, symptoms may include urinary frequency, hematuria, bubbly urine, fatigue, insomnia, dry skin and itchiness, bipedal edema, or swelling of feet, or loss of appetite. Creatinine and urinalysis are the recommended screening tests for CKD. If your kidneys are damaged, albumin or protein can leak out of your kidneys into the urine. We can also request for urine albumin CREA ratio or the 24-hour urine protein to quantify the amount of protein in the urine. Imaging like kidney ultrasound can help establish the chronicity of the disease. For proper evaluation and treatment, consult with a board-certified nephrologist. Happy World Kidney Day! Thank you for watching!